In St. Louis County police are investigating the shooting death of a teen in Lee May. Fox 2's Jeff Bernthal is live tonight from Clayton with the latest on where that investigation stands. Jeff. And Mandy, we don't know if this shooting was accidental or intentional. We just don't know the circumstances. Police here not in a position to release those details at this point. They were on the scene in Lee May for hours. Crime tape blocked off Getz Avenue at Gentry Tuesday afternoon. Police secured that block for approximately five hours while their investigation moved forward. Right across the street is the Hancock Place School District Office and Early Childhood Center. The early information from police was that a teen boy was dead after suffering an apparent gunshot wound. It is heartbreaking. Tuesday night, Jennifer Fruworth walked her dog down the street where just a few hours earlier, she walked with her child from the childhood center as police arrived on the scene. You never know if it could happen to your child or anybody else's child. A neighbor living behind the home where the teen died said he heard a gunshot, then heard yelling to call for an ambulance. Another nearby resident said there were several teens inside the home when the tragedy occurred. Very sad. I got kids of my own. You know, first thing I thought of, I want to run up and hug them, hug them and make sure they were good. Neighbor Rick Belcher said he does not know what happened, but hopes anyone using a gun will recognize potential dangers. People need to learn that guns could kill, you know, just leave them alone if you don't know how to do it. At this point, police not releasing the identity of the victim. Neighbors we spoke with expressing their condolences to the victim's family. Reporting live from Clayton, Jeff Bernthal, Fox 2 News.